welcome to Future Build. Nice Thanks to see you. Yeah, and you. So obviously yeah. we're here today to look at the new GSE Imru yeah, system. Absolutely. And the flexibility and the compatibility it has within the new build market yeah. and all of the new panel sizes that are coming out in the market as well. Yeah, exactly. So if you just want to run us through some of the main characteristics of the system. Yeah, so more than one year ago we decided to, uh, to launch the new frames in order to accommodate the larger panel like this one, which are uh, 415 watts. But in the near future we'll be even able to accommodate uh, panels uh, up to 600 watts and even 800 watts in the, in the future. They think about, they, they speak about uh, uh, larger panels with much more uh, uh, wattage capacity. So basically, the concept is, uh, is the same than before, the, 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 the now in roof frames, but instead of having one full frame, we have two half frames. Uh, because otherwise, you, you will have bigger and bigger um, frames and it's, it will be much easier for the, for the PV installers or the roofer to carry half a frame on the roof. So the principle is the same. You have six fixing points uh, of our frames on the roof and then you are simply hanging the, the PV module on, the, on, the, on, our, on our frames. It's a MCS certified product. Uh, we have also all the, the certification in terms of fire with most of the PV modules available in the UK market. So really, our product is, is absolutely flexible with, uh, with uh, different PV modules, uh, brands and sizes. This yes, is that really keeps the flexibility in the market, doesn't it? Yeah, exactly. And this is why Futurelec recently have decided to um, have a commercial partnership with GSE, because it gives us great flexibility um, and compatibility with the growing market within the panels. Um, and it both now being on portrait and landscape, um, you know, we've recently installed 170 back plates on, on a site over the last couple of weeks, which was uh, quite a challenging site because we had dormer windows, we had Velux windows, we had landscape, we had portrait, portrait and landscape on some same properties. Um, and what we found that the GSE and Roo system give us was real, real great flexibility. Um, and now with the new system coming out with the, the split back plate, it gives us that compatibility with the, with the increased wattage on the panels as Julian has stated. You know, so, so moving forward, you know, we will be able to accommodate any system design on any property moving forward, yeah. which is great. That's okay, and uh, just to finish with, with those new frames, able to accommodate larger panels, we are already anticipating the, the part L coming uh, from June, the first part of part L from June 22, and the second part in 2023. So with our in-roof uh, integration frames for PV modules, we'll be able to get much more power on the roof with less, less PV modules. Considering the space that you can have on, a, on, a, on an English or on a, on a roof in the UK, that's, uh, that's, uh, this is something that we wanted to absolutely uh, develop. Yeah, and, it, and there's currently no other inline in-roof system that's able to give that that sort of flexibility with the bigger panels and Julian rightfully said there were part L coming up the more panels we can get in a smaller space on the roofs you know the, the, the better yeah. you know, it's going to be keep the cost down for the client it's going to keep the insulation time down for the installer you know so it's, it's a win-win situation for all yeah.